Welcome back, West Texas. Happy Wednesday. Now let's talk the latest in sports. Well, the very best Lady Falcons have had plenty of athletes sign their letter of intent this week. Now today it was Emily Ward signing to Cisco College to continue her rodeo career. Now Ward has been a multi-sport athlete throughout her four years at Very Best High and now looks to continue her journey at the two-year school. Now here is the moment where all of her dreams came true. It's been a true pleasure watching Emily grow up to be the competitive and successful young lady that she is. Please help me congratulate Miss Emily Ward as she signs her letter of intent to compete in rodeo at Cisco College. All right, and let's not stop now. Let the awards keep coming. Also, Emily Scott earned the title of the regional champion in girls singles tennis after her performance at the Bentwood Country Club. Now, Scott will now play at the state tournament within the next couple of weeks, but we caught up with her to talk about how it feels to be the first tennis player to advance to state in over a decade. It means a lot to me, especially I haven't been playing tennis that long. It's just, it's so exciting to get to play at the state level. I think just the people here just, you know, always encouraging me to be the best player I can be and pushing me to work harder. And now let's check in with the Angelo State softball team who fell short in their last game facing Texas A&M International. The final 1-8, to eight, but the Rambels already secured the series Tuesday when they came away 9-2 to two and then 3-2. to two. Now the team will now return back to Meyer Field where they will face Lubbock Christian in their home finale. All righty, West Texas. Well, hey, that will do it in sports, but stick around. Some more news coming your way after the break.